नमस्कार वेलकम टू डी एन एन वॉइस ऑफ नेशन यू आर वॉचिंग प्राइम न्यूज अनलेफ वायोलेटिंग सीज फायर अग्रीमेंट इन मणिपुर एविडेंस ऑफ इन्वॉल्वमेंट इन वायलेंट एक्टिविटीज रिव्यू डिस्कवर द शॉकिंग ट्रूथ बिहाइंड द यूनाइटेड नेशनल लिबरेशन फ्रंट अनलेफ ब्रीच ऑफ द सीज फायर अग्रीमेंट इन मणिपुर डिस्पाइट प्लेजेस टू रिनाउंस वायलेंस Recent reports unveil disturbing activities implicating UNLF members in violent acts against civilians and security forces. Stay informed as security agencies uncover the extent of UNLF's involvement in destabilizing Manipur, shedding light on their camps and targeted operations. The United National Liberation Front (UNLF) is violating the ceasefire agreement in Manipur. Security agencies have expressed concern over increasing violence in Manipur despite the signing of the ceasefire agreement, officials said on Sunday. UNLF P on 29th November 2023 became the first MITE armed group to sign a ceasefire agreement with the government in Imphal Valley and agree to give up violence however reports indicate that members of the group are setting up camps on the outskirts of kuki populated areas to target tr1 bilays anlf p cadre have been involved in violent activities against security forces and the general public officials said the cadre was involved in looting arms and ammunition from the 5th India Reserve Battalion in Chingarel in Manipur East on 13th February After this incident police have arrested 6 people including two unlf cadre On 7th February the unlf p cadre opened fire at Moirangapurel on vehicles heading towards Churchandpur a district dominated by the Kuki community Anlf P cadre were allegedly giving live updates on social media claiming to be targeting the Kuki community The Anlf established in 1964 has been active both within and outside Indian territory Since 2014 the center has signed agreements with several armed groups in the northeast to end insurgency and promote development 